Hi, my name is Jacob. So you're having a party, maybe even a wedding, and you want a photo booth. It's quite popular these days. It's pretty easy. All you need is an iPad and this app that I've made called Guestbook Go, which turns the iPad into a photo booth. So it looks like this. There's your event with a title, and there's a button, and you just press the button to start the photo booth. And you're presented with a selfie and a button to start the countdown. So I'll just frame my picture here. Let's see, that looks good. And I press to start the countdown, three seconds, and there it is. And I get the result. And I can just press to accept the photo or reject the photo, in which case it won't be stored in memory. So I like this photo. I press to accept, and I'm presented with the option to label this photo. Now you can turn this off in settings, but I want to label this photo. Great. Now, fun party maybe. Fun party. And now, when I press the green check mark to, I can also change the font here if I want. And you can also turn that off in settings. And now I'm presented with the result. And it's that easy. And it's just on for the next person to take their picture. The great thing about the iPad and the iPhone, which this app also supports, you can try it on the iPhone too, it's the same. It's that they have guided access mode, which means you can turn off all the buttons and control, control center and that stuff, which limits people's ability to, you know, leave the app. So this app is going to run, run until you stop it. It's going to run for hours until you stop it. And so that's pretty great. So you want to set this iPad, of course, in a good position. And you really need good lighting on the subject because the front camera of these devices is not as good as the back camera. So you need good lighting. And maybe you want to change, arrange the background so it's elegant or fun, maybe some glitter, I don't know. It's all up to you. Uh, and depending on what party it is, you might want to have some props for people to, you know, make take fun pictures. So this app also supports any language. Everything you see here is all these labels are customizable, so you can you can support any language you want. And this app, this function is part of three functions in this app. There's also a video message function for people to leave video messages. And there's a scribble function, more like the traditional guestbook of writing. So all these function in, the, in this app. If you're curious about the other functions, you can check out my guide video that's linked below. And if you want to try this app, it's in the App Store. There's a link down below to download it. If you do have any questions, leave a comment and I'll try to get to those. And I guess if you do try it, I wish you good luck and thanks for watching.